report. Well, it was reported this week that on a trip to Washington, D.C. last month, Senators Patty Murray and Slade Gorton refused to have their pictures taken with a group of Seattle 8th graders. Later, it was revealed that Senator Murray was actually in the photo, but blended right in among the 8th grade girls. <laughs> A study reports that fewer school children brought guns to school this year than last, but the number of kids with knives continues to increase. The study says that these figures should start to balance out as the remaining students with guns shoot more of the knife carriers. <laughs> Canada may be willing to make concessions in the negotiations with the United States over the Pacific Salmon Treaty. One of the concessions uh, proposed is that Canada would have to take back Celine Dion. <laughs> A female guest of the Edgewater Inn was taken to Harborview for evaluation after jumping nude into the sound at 5 in the morning. A spokesperson for the hotel mentioned that the guest had been despondent about her cable access show having been canceled. <laughs> the King County... The King County government has awarded $5.7 million for low-income housing, but due to an oversight, the money will go towards the building of one incredibly huge, really nice house. <laughs> well, a number of local celebrities competed in an oyster slurping contest this week as part of Oyster Appreciation Week. Apparently then, the appropriate way to show appreciation for oysters is by eating them alive. <laughs> Keep that in mind later this summer when the Mariners try to sell you tickets for Fan Appreciation Night. <laughs> A Vancouver, B.C. woman is on trial for obstruction of justice after allegedly having an affair with an accused killer while serving on the jury that acquitted him. When asked to comment, the woman said, I know he beat her with a crowbar, chopped her into pieces, and buried her head in the backyard, but damn it, I love him. <laughs> Finally, two more Western Washington dairies have been fined for allowing cow manure to flow into area waterways. It's all part of the Washington Dairy Farmers' new ad campaign, Drink Milk Because the Water's Full of Crap. <laughs> this has been The Late Report. Thank you, and we'll see you in September.